Ben. Nice to Ben. Ben, I'll see you soon, pal. Oh, prior to installation. Why don't we just do what it says? Oh, oh we probably shouldn't do that at all. Oh, 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 Jesus. <laughs> That's not good. Thank God Jesus is not here, eh? Ha 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 yeah, Jaden Jaden can't wait for chicken. Look at that look at that face. Look at that face. She loves the chicken. Yeah, I'm giving her some chicken. So some days you just have to have chicken breast, a little bit of ketchup for, for flavor, and away you go. Ketchup and chicken breast. Mm. Uh, I didn't go to the gym today. I needed a day off. My shoulders and back were killing me, which is a good sign. I mean I trained hard. Uh, but you got to listen to your body. Remember, that is one of the keys to succeeding on any program is you have to listen to your body. If you don't listen to your body, you can overtrain, you can tear muscles, you can pull muscles, and you can just get burnt out, which you don't want to do. Um, I think in a couple of weeks, I'm going to start doing some classes at the YMCA, which should be fun. I'm not sure which ones I'm going to do, but I'm going to try, I'll try them all, uh, whatever, I'll try everything once. Um, zoo. I don't know what that was up there, but uh, Zumba or or the spinning class or um, Pil I don't know whatever they got. I'm gonna try. So that should be fun. You know, shake your body up, get something different going on. Um, I'm still running on track. Today was a perfect day again. Uh, I had a great day of eating, drank lots of water, had lots of fruit, I uh, got lots of fiber, um, and I had my chicken breast as you see, you saw. And tonight I'll probably have some hot air popcorn because if you have hot air popcorn but nothing on it, it's got a lot of fiber. So that's a good thing too. So I think I'll have some hot air popcorn tonight as a snack for the movie. Uh, last night, didn't watch a movie for one of the first times. I don't know what happened last night. But anyways, I was busy. Uh, me and Carl had a date. So I went out and, uh, and did my thing with Carl. And uh, oh, I had to do my, my uh, ode to Ben. So, um, you know... Uh, like I said, if you uh, if, if you stick, like I said, like I'm going to say, if you stick to the thing, even on your days off, it, it makes the weekends that much better and that much brighter. If you can go five days a week um, and, and, and eat perfectly and try to get some exercise in, then it makes the Saturday night with the UFC and Sunday with the Super Bowl all day where I'm going to have wings, I'm going to have sausages, I'm going to have... Um, nachos. I'm going to have uh, lots of uh, apple juice with ice. Um, you know, it makes those days really, really, really fun and exciting. So, that's your reward for doing so well all throughout the week. So, for all of you that are following along, for all of you that are that are on a program of your own, I hope you're doing fantastic. Remember that the key is to speed up your metabolism, and the way that you speed up your metabolism is to eat small portions throughout the day, often eat often, drink tons of water, get rid, of your, get rid of toxins. If you could do two things today, the two most important things to shape up, get into shape, lose weight, and, and burn some fat and speed up your metabolism, if you want to know two things, only two things, drink a lot of water throughout the day and eat six to seven small, complete meals a day. And remember, when I say a meal, I'm not talking about, I'm talking about like a yogurt and almonds is a complete meal because you have your carbs, your protein, and your fats. So, you know, I wouldn't have that for supper, obviously, but if you want to have your, your, your morning uh, protein drink, you want to have that as a snack in between. Then you have your lunch where you have your rice and your pasta or your rice and pasta or potatoes and, and um, fish and chicken and steak and all that kind of stuff. And then have another snack in between and then have your supper, which is mostly low glycemic car carbohydrates. And you have your protein at supper time and have, you know, your salads and your greens and your, your, all that good stuff. And then for a snack at night, you can have your, your, you know, popcorn, air popcorn, or you can have, um, you know, another protein drink with, with not a whole lot of fruit. You can have, there's lots and lots and lots of things that you can have. So there's, a, there's a lot of uh, really good ways to do it. But the key is to eat often and drink lots of water. Those, those two things alone, along with exercise, you're well on your way.